Hello everyone, it's me JP from Init Tutorials. Today, in this video, I'll show you how to disable or enable local group policy editor in any Windows computer. So, without further more delay, let's begin. So, firstly, let me show you. Just press Win plus R on your computer keyboard to open the run program. And in the run program, just type this name gpedit.msc and just hit enter or you can just click on OK. Now it will open up the local group policy editor, which is also known as zpedit.msc, right? So right now my local group policy editor is being enabled. So sometimes what happens if in your case in my find that local group policy editor is unable to start, then this might happen due to it might have been disabled. So in order to enable or disable the local group policy, firstly what you need to do is just open any web browser and just visit to this website link. I'll be providing this website link too in the video description. So you can click there and visit to this website link. And after that you will see one command written here. You can just copy it or you can just download this file also. So let me copy it. And after that just click on the Windows start menu icon. And the search box is search for one program name as command from just search the program command from as you can see here and now on the right side you can see your run as administrator right so you need to run this command from as run as administrator just click on run as administrator now just paste the text here and just hit enter now you are seeing the operation completed successfully so now you can just minimize it and once again on your computer keyboard just press win plus r to open the run program and in the run program just once again type gpedit.msc after that hit enter or click on ok now you can see here the snap in below has been restricted by policy contact your administrator for details group policy object editor right so now our local group policy editor has been disabled so now in order to enable it again what you need to do is just once again open back the command from by opening it as run as administrator and now once again just press the same text and now here instead of this one just put here zero and after that just hit enter now once again you will see the operation completed successfully right so now you can just close it and once again on your computer keyboard just press win plus r to open the run program and once again just type gpedit.msc and you can hit enter or you can just click on ok voila now you can see our local group policy editor program is able to start again so by using these cool tricks you can easily disable or enable local group policy editor in any windows computer very easily so if you never known about the school tricks then you should definitely give it a try so if you find this video tutorial useful please click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to your channel click on the subscribe button and lastly thanks for watching